Prussian forces enter battle, to liberate Elba Camel region. The Russian armed forces, unleashed a massive assault, on the Islamic States' ISIS positions in southeastern, the ERS war this past weekend. Relying on their advanced jets, the Russian Air Force carried out dozens of airstrikes over the Al Bukhamel region of the Azor, inflicting heavy damage on the Islamic State's already battered defenses. With the Islamic State's defenses deeply fractured, the Syrian Arab Armist Tiger Forces were able to make significant progress along the Mayadeen Al Bukhamel Road liberating more than 10 kilometers of territory from the terrorists on Sunday. In order to keep up the pressure on the Islamic State, the Russian Air Force has also began launching night raids over the southeastern countryside of the Eris War. These night raids by the Russian Air Force have proven incredibly effective as the Islamic State has been unable to fortify their positions at al Bukhamel, which greatly benefits the Syrian army. When the Syrian army first seized al Bukhamel, it was done without much help from the Russian Air Force. This was because Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps Irk, was leading the operation. However, after failing to secure the city, the Russian military stepped in to aid the government forces in their imperative counter-offensive to regain control of al Bukhamel and its surroundings. The Russian Air Force has already provided a major boost to the Syrian army in this region and they will likely play an instrumental role in the eventual liberation of the Mayadeen al Bukhamel Road. Why can insurgents gather in new, coalition-controlled areas to launch an attack on the Syrian army near Abu Kamal? Bing New. Thank you for watching.